everyone. Sorry it's so loud. I'm driving my 2001 Ford E350 Econoline van, which has the terrible 5.4 Triton in it. And as you can hear, a spark plug has popped out. Now, the common thing to do to fix this is, of course, to retap the spark plug threads or to put in an insert for it. But the problem is that I'm on the road and I really, really can't pull over. Sorry, I'm downshifting. You can't really pull over and just re-tap the threads on the side of the highway. So, as you can see, I've got 212 miles on the odometer. Almost all of these 212 miles have been without one of my eight spark plugs, which means effectively I'm running on seven cylinders. It's a really common question to ask when, and there are a lot of threads about this, people blow these spark plugs, can I drive my van or my truck or my whatever to the shop to go get it fixed? And the answer is yes, you can, pretty much indefinitely, because I've still got about 300 miles to go on this little trip I'm doing, and I have confidence, I'm completely confident it'll make it just fine. But the caveat is that you have to unplug the injector from the engine on the cylinder that the spark plug is missing from. The reasoning being that if you have no spark plug, the engine doesn't know this, immediately at least, and it will continue to dump fuel into the cylinder that will never be able to burn. Now, I've heard that the engine will eventually realize there is a misfire on that cylinder and turn off injection to that cylinder, but really, why risk it? So, the mitigation of this, if you have to drive a 5.4 Triton or whatever your engine is with a blown spark plug, probably Ford, unfortunately, is you need to unplug the injector going to that cylinder, and you need to double check that you've unplugged the correct injector. Really, all it amounts to is if you've unplugged the injector, you've just got what is a essentially a dead misfire on one cylinder. The air going out of the top of the head should be more than enough to keep any foreign object from falling inside of the spark plug hole, because you know, the, the air is going to whoosh out from the top because there's nothing holding in place. So you shouldn't have to worry about anything falling in, and you're not going to hurt anything running an engine with nothing on that cylinder other than what's probably going to be abhorrent performance, as you can already see. I mean, I'm really having difficulty keeping up to speed. Um, thankfully, the AC still works, though. But you shouldn't really notice any mechanical issues other than the fact that your engine is going to be down whatever one-eighth of one eighth is in percent. What is that? 12.5? Something like that? So anyway, long and short of it is, if you pop the spark plug in your 5.4 Triton, which odds are you probably did, it's okay to keep driving it around if you need to go somewhere, as long as you unplug the injector from the cylinder itself. I wish you the best of luck in repairs if you do have a pop spark plug. It's not very fun, and we've all been there if we have a 5.4. Um, yeah, thanks for watching, and good luck.